What is up, Matthew DeMoe here with a Space Jump review. However, today we're gonna to be doing Fan Friday, a new series where you guys get to pick what I listen to. Whether it's an album, a single, a music video, mix, whether you want me to listen to the latest and greatest hit or if you want me to listen to some old classics, it's completely up to you guys. For now, I'm just gonna have you guys comment on YouTube what you guys want, but eventually, if Reddit or Facebook's pop in, then we can do some sort of upvote voting system on those platforms. Since I didn't pull for any artist of choice today, we're going to be listening to an artist that I haven't got around to yet, but I've been meaning to for quite a while. His name's Weethan. I initially heard of him because he was on another artist, Oliver Tree's videos, and I've seen him perform with Louis the Child and a couple of the artists that I really like, but I've never been able to listen to his discography from beginning to end, so that's what we're going to be doing today. Already I'm seeing on a SoundCloud page a Brockhampton remix, a Lord remix, song with Oliver Tree, and an EP with Louis the Child. So again, I believe I haven't listened to any of his songs, so let's get into it. So the first song we're listening to is Weathan's remix of Stains by Brockhampton. Really big fan of Brockhampton, especially the third album, so. Oh, this is good. I already know the song has some really cool synths on it, really cool tempo, so let's take a look. Oh, that is gonna be nice. Okay. Like a year and a half and and he's got the vocal in too. Way to see this girl. A little mirror verse. Keep my job. Keep the fly stand by. Lay to the airplane. Oh, yeah. This is supposed to be a better version of the original song. If it really just has a little vocals in it. Too. So we're gonna go back into the uh, synth draw. This is actually really. This is fun. This is fun. Ooh. That transition. Spotify? I don't know how he's gonna clear this song, but oh, it's on Spotify. That's a good introduction, Weathan. I would listen to that all day. Okay, so what should we do next? Let's do the um, Lou the Child Weathan EP titled Honey. Save the Bees. Alright, so the first song is EP is Chop It Up. That's that. Not bad showing by either. Definitely not my favorite. Lose a Child and Weathan song. You know, I'm gonna listen to one Weathan song, so. There's a lot of great 
great panic. Stare your shit going on this off. There's some nasty stereo panic going on in this song. A lot of left, right, saws and claps. Alright, we're adding that. That's getting liked. We're gonna give that one the like button on SoundCloud. Third song, happy birthday. Oh, this turned into a bop real quick. <laughs> I think it would be hilarious if you walked into a club and they're just playing Happy Birthday by Louis the Child and Weathen. Such a blissful, happy dance song that I think it would be kind of uncanny just to see girls twerking and everyone just binge drinking it to like some crazy strobe lights. Uh, next one is Drip Drip. so far. I don't even know how to describe how fat that song was. You just have to listen to it. And that was also the one song out of the four so far that you don't need a vocal, you don't need any more bells and whistles. Drip Drip's good. You just send that. Put it on Spotify, please. The next one is Tango Mas. The snare's good. This song is definitely confusing. I mean, usually with South of the board music, I'm kind of used to moon baton, but this... Oh, there it is. Like, is this really lit? Is this really... You're gonna be drunk to pop off to this. I think this has to be a joke. It just like structure and tension. It's just not a great song. Unless something's about to happen. Yeah, we're skipping it. We're gonna skip. Tengamas, that's an L. Uh, last song, Synth, Synth with Bangs. Has a tough title to pronounce. That's a crunchy clap. see Weathen Louie the Child and Tor because together they make some really fun music. Alright, what other singles can we do? Oh, he's got a song with Flux Pavilion and Max. I don't know who Max is, but go back to UKF dubstep days. Oh, is Max the singer? Maybe. Michael Connor in the comments says best song ever. We'll see. That's a thick face. Did not expect it to go back into it again. Here's who Max is. If he's a producer or he's the vocalist. Either way, he's doing his job. I can show 
this is my bomb and she'd like it. How was that? How was that? A year? Yeah, like I said, I can try to a lot of people to enjoy it, including myself. Alright, let's do one more. Most popular song is this first one, it's got 10 million on it. And then we have Weathen vs. Oliver Tree. Let's do the Oliver Tree song, When I'm Down. Oliver Tree is actually a really good vocalist. I really like the style. It should be good. My hair blows up when I'm alone. I shut my eyes in my mouth and my legs just get wow. Why in the world would you hit me when I'm down? I get lost in and out when you walk in and out. Then my hair in and out. I get stuck in and out when I'm down. When I'm down. down. This is one of the most Coachella songs I've heard in a while. That schmood. My head blows up when I'm alone. I shut my eyes and my mouth and my legs just get out. See, he's talking about really depressing stuff, but it sounds happy, so it contradicts it, you know? It's a great drinking song. That was the Weathen reaction. Listen to about eight songs. So if I miss something, whatever, if you're like, oh no, oh no, he didn't, he didn't listen to this song. How could he have missed this Weathen song? Just comment below and we'll do a Weathen part two, I think. So comment whether Weathen kicks ass or not and also what you think the next Fan Friday video should be about. Also, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. When I'm down. When I'm down I ain't been getting high But maybe a little baby I don't wanna lie I know when you text me girl I don't always reply Well you're not an angel either You can't even fly I